Hello, I'm Dil for Yala Media, and today I'm going to be showcasing an annoying bug that is present in Files Go by Google. So this is a Nokia 2.1. Uh, it is running on the August security patch with Android 8.1 of your Go. It has just been very recently uh, factory reset it with a few applications installed. All applications have been updated, including Files Go. So you can see there are no updates available, and Files Go by Google has been fully. Updated. So I'm going to open up the application. So currently it reports 4.1 out of 8 gigabytes used. So I'm going to now go into the settings. I'm going to go to storage. And as you can see, I've also got an SD card inserted in this phone. As you can see, SD card is inserted into the phone. And it is formatted as internal storage so while editing the video I realized I left something out and what I left out was when you first insert an SD card into the phone it will ask you whether you want to format it as portable storage or format it as internal storage if you set it as internal storage it will then prompt you whether you want to migrate the data now or migrate the data later in my case, I migrate. I would chose to migrate the data later, and the rest of this video is reflective of that decision. But if you choose to migrate the data now, you will have the same issue, the same bug that will be displayed later also in this video. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and migrate the data from the internal shared storage to the SD card. And to do that, you just go to the SD card, you go more options, and you go migrate data. So it's asking you to whether you want to move the data now. This is the voice text screen. Okay. So I'm going to go, go ahead and go press move and it's going to go ahead and move the data. This is in a this is in real time. I'm not going to speed up the footage. Okay, so it says that SD card is ready and SD card is ready. So I'm gonna go ahead and press. Okay, unfortunately my camera has poor auto focusing and I stopped the recording. And for some reason, when I press the to stop recording, it didn't start recording. So I basically pressed done. And now I'm gonna go into files go. And as you can see, it now reports 22.38 gigabytes, negative 22.38 gigabytes out of 8 gigabytes. I'm going to reverse my action I've done earlier, and that is to go into the internal shared storage and press more options and migrate data. So it's basically going to reverse the action I did just now by moving the data from the SD card to the internal shared storage. So I'm going to press move. I do not understand why it keeps going from 20%, 80%, 20%, 80%. I guess this is another bug with that's present in 8.1 Oreo Go opposed because this isn't this this is this is not Files Go. The problem with Files Go is that it's very tightly integrated with the Android Go operating system. So now it's done. I'm now going to go to back to Files Go and there you guys go. It now reports 4.1 gigabytes out of 8 gigabytes. What is annoying about this is that this is a Nokia 1. It too runs Android 8.1 Oreo Go Edition. And as you can see in SD card, so I've also got the same scenario where I've got internal shared storage and an SD card. SD card is set uh, formatted as internal storage. So if I go to SD card, I am not given the prompt to migrate data in the sense that I've already migrated the data when I've inserted the SD card. 
and when I go to files go, it correctly reports 3.04 gigabytes out of 8 gigabytes. For my understanding, files go is supposed to only display correct, uh, it's only supposed to display the available storage, the used storage of the internal shared storage. And when I was inserting the micro SD card for this Nokia One, which is actually my mother's, the same problem of the negative number being reported was present, and to fix that, I had to format the reset the phone. And then after resetting the phone, I would then format the SD card as internal storage. I did the same thing, and while it fixed the problem on my mother's Nokia One, it did not fix the problem on my Nokia 2.1. And that is the annoying bug. I thought I'd be able to fix it, but unfortunately I'm unable to. So I have my great data, move. So yeah, uh, I, 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 yeah I, this is just one of a few different issues I have in my Nokia 2.1 software-wise. Uh, that's been my demonstration of the of annoying bug in, a, in Files Go by Google. It's going to move back the data from the internal sto shared storage to the SD card. That's Windows PC notification. Great. Done. So as you can see, I'm going to show the similarities between these two devices. So, both of them have internal shared storage and both of them have SD cards formatted as internal storage. So if I go to SD card, if I go to more options, they are both both of them have had my um, the data migrated from internal shared storage to the SD card because when I go to internal shared storage, I go to the more options, I'm given the option to migrate data from the SD card to the internal shared storage. And when I go to Google and when I go to the files go by Google, uh, here it is. This phone incorrectly displays the internal shared storage available and used capacity and this phone correctly identifies the used and available internal shared storage capacity. So, I don't know how to fix this and it's annoying. Yes.